better. But I tried to hook up the mics this morning. I got them to work finally, but I can't plug it in to the camera or to the cell phone and use the gimbal. So I'm making do with what I got for now. But I really hope to get rid of that wind sound. I hate that when I'm trying to watch a replay. It's no good. What's everybody doing this morning? What's everybody doing? Cool, sound is good, all right, all right. Thanks for the input, appreciate that. Be sure you like the video, subscribe, leave a super thanks, or become a member. Jim needs new shoes. <laughs> Jim needs new shoes. I got a pair of these flat bottom Nikes I've been wearing for the walks and I don't know if they're my favorite, but, but Jim needs new shoes. Maybe someone can recommend some awesome walking shoes or something for a feller my age. Those upper 40s walking kicks. <laughs> right? Are we outside? It's early. I'm trying to get a little walk in before I get super busy today. I feel like today I'm coming down on my last couple of days of of retirement, I feel like. Gotta go back back to work Monday. So start work Monday. Back to work forever probably. Might get a haircut this afternoon. It's going slow today. I'm gonna go slow today. I've been getting up early though, doing my exercising in the morning. It's been super cool. Oh, the video looks good too. All right, thank you for the input. Appreciate that. Yeah. But yeah, my other phone, I don't know if it was terrible or or what, but it wasn't good. <laughs> it, the screen was all cracked on it and stuff. It was getting hard to look at. So, buckled down. Got another cell phone. I go through about six a year. I went through five last year. Five or six, I think. I got a whole pile of them in my... <laughs> a whole pile of them. Yeah, I appreciate that, man. Yeah, it was great work that we did. Uh, thank you. Um, yeah, it's just got to do something different. That, that show kind of spiraled me out of control, so... Uh, I'm excited to get myself back. A uh, little re, no rebranding probably, but definitely a different look if it ever does come back. It'll be some time. We're talking six, eight, nine, ten months a year maybe. Uh, but a different way to do it so I don't have to spend all day doing it. I know that sounds crazy, but... But I would spend 10, 12, 15 hours a day sometimes working on the program, which allowed zero space for anything else. So. Okay. Hello, fellow trail users. Yeah, so I don't know what you guys got going on today, but it's Friday. I have the urge maybe to want to go out tonight, but not really, <laughs> not really. Yeah, a vacation would be nice. <laughs> um, a vacation would be nice. I'm gonna start on some simple things in life, like a new pair of shoes. Drop your super things down below so Jim can get a new pair of shoes. Um, no. I'm going to start on some simple stuff. Making breakfast in the morning for just myself. Taking care of just myself. It's kind of fun. It's kind of fun. I don't know if it's... I don't know if I want to call it selfish, but... The way... The way I want to live is a little more independent. A little more just to myself. So... I'm just going to walk and tell them... 
just gonna walk until then. But it's beautiful out today though. The, the weather's really mild right now. Nice little light breeze. And this trail has done me good. I was trying to say like over the last like three weeks. Yeah, fuck July too. July, I'm so glad July is over. But during July, I did so much walking on this trail. <laughs> Hey there. I did so much walking on this trail. Yeah, self-care. Take some self-care. Take some time to take care of yourself, everybody. Also, too, expanding your friend circle. That has been the coolest thing for me, I feel like. Like, I had dinner with a group of people that I, have, I don't know at all the other night, four, five, six of them. Yeah, it was really refreshing. It was really refreshing to just be at a table with people who, that didn't expect anything from me and didn't know a lot about me. It was kind of nice. It was kind of nice. The berries are about to come in here, it looks like, too. There's a nice little berry patch on the way out of this park I always hit. But yeah, just, uh, I'm trying to be like a male boat model. You ever want to look at like a, a boat advertisement? It's always some like hairy 45 year old dude hanging out on the side of a boat. <laughs> but he always looks really good. Maybe not the hairy part, but I'm definitely going for the in shape 45 year old dude. Right? Right? Yeah. Yeah, thanks for hanging in with me on the walk. It's weird to make content, I feel like, with these lives that I don't know if anybody even enjoys and I don't even really care. It's the first time I've made like this kind of content where I'm like, well, this is what I can provide um, and still feel good about myself currently, so that's what I'm going to do. And I have a monetized channel that I worked really hard to get monetized super hard to get monetized and I'm only making like a dollar a day so uh, it makes it tough it makes it tough but if you work this hard to, to build something um oh thanks yeah yeah I, hopefully I get to go to like some different places eventually and go on walks but every time I get in the car I, I keep forgetting to like bring the gimbal and then of course I'm like right by a park and then I feel like oh crap I should have brought the should have brought the gimbal but but that's what I've been doing that's what I've been doing maybe one of these days some people would like to go on a walk with me I would be down for that I'd like to go on a walk with someone maybe we can just have a conversation not an interview a conversation You don't have to interview your friends. You just talk to them. <laughs> it's probably just as fun. <laughs> don't want to do that. Okay. All right. All the good tips, too. Thanks for all the tips. People that have any experience with streaming or live channels or... Or anything let me know uh, the live content is really easy to make um, it gives you an option to do what's called like a DVR of your live which you can then turn into regular content on the channel which is what I've done with all the walking videos I started dating them uh, yesterday as like a I don't know like a way to like look back I guess I'm not sure but I figured it was easy for people to look through since I'm using the same thumbnail all the time. And anyone that's interested in what I'm doing in my life, I'll be able to share some of that during these lives. Not that anybody, not that I'm that important or interesting, but it's just one more way to, here we go. I do it every day. I almost fell yesterday. Let's go through it today. Whoop. Oh, oh I made it. 
I made it. But for anybody out there outside of Portland, that's kind of the, the new crowd I'm hoping to, to maybe gather. There's more people outside of Portland. If you're not from Portland and you're watching, then tell me where you're from. Maybe, maybe I'll come to you and go for a walk. But just trying to keep it consistent. Like I was saying, it's easier too. So after the walk, I just go home and click just a few buttons. I'll come over. Yeah, meet up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, I think the interview portion of my life is kind of done. I don't want to dig. I don't want to. I mean, I'm not, it's not sound mean, but I don't want to do research anymore because that's the part that was kind of. That's the part that I felt like I was kind of good at, but that's the part that takes forever. Getting to know you guys via the internet. Who that be? Oh, what's up, Rated Ill? My guy, Wino. Out on these walks. I can, uh, I'm on like day 10 or something of doing these like daily walks. Trying to provide some content for the monetized channel that I wish not to die. So once again, become a member for $4.99 a month. Even if you only do it for one month, I won't be mad. You can leave a super thanks at the bottom. Um, again, content creators, we only get paid in increments of $100. So my channel makes about a dollar a day. And that means that it takes about three months <laughs> to get a hundred bucks. So anything I can do to speed up that process from month to month is always super helpful. Uh, we, I, as a content creator, use the money that I earn generally right back in the program. I bought this gimbal that I'm using. The mics that I got, I'm so stoked that I got that to work this morning, but I can't plug it into my phone on the gimbal. So I got to back to the drawing board with that. So you got to use the cell phone audio for now. But that's something I hope to get squared away. But again, content creators, we only get paid in increments of 100 from YouTube. So if you strike out at the end of the month at $94, and then you got to wait. <laughs> you got to wait. Hello, hello, how's everybody doing? Mrs. Wills. Mr. Wheels, I'm sorry I couldn't see it. It goes away really quickly. Um, but yeah, we're here at the... I've been walking this park every day. This downtown, Fairview, Troutdale um, area here. Really nice, clean walking path, little neighborhood. It's usually really quiet. Not a lot going on. Yeah, but in efforts to keep myself moving and whatnot I've been doing these little lives oh Shado bro hey how are you sorry sorry I can't <laughs> they go they like they like show up on the feed and disappear thanks for watching man big ups to my guys Danny Ocean and Shado they got some dope platforms out here in Portland exposing exposing artists uh, and also exposing uh, the Portland nightlife culture which I definitely appreciate it, and so does everybody else. Super cool, super cool. Never got a chance to get Danny like all the way on my show, but me and Shado, he made me a drink. If you guys know me, I don't drink very much, very rarely, <laughs> very rarely. Uh, and he made me a drink at his house. It was like a horchata or something, I can't remember. It was super good, I drank it way too fast, and he got me on his interview. A uh, little bit loose lipped. So check out <laughs> check out Shado's content for uh, for that interview. It was pretty good. It was good. I had a good time. Great host. Great host. I see uh, Rose and friends. Our friend Rose Gulshan. He has a new show, and he was talking on his episode when I was watching this morning about uh, he's got bottles on the show. <laughs> Yeah, no problem, Shado. Love you, friend. Love you, friend. But we out here walking today. Jim needs new shoes. You can leave a super thanks. Become a member uh, down at the bottom. Help me out. Help me out. Jim needs new shoes. <laughs> maybe I'll change the maybe I'll change the thumbnail today. They do a really great job in this neighborhood of 
taking care of all the plants. Like they just watered all these like last couple of days. They do a great job. Really nice neighborhood. Nice and quiet. Nice and quiet. But I'll show you the little path trail that kind of loops around here. And this goes a couple of different places too. <laughs> That's what it was. <laughs> Bourbon slide. That thing had me jacked up, boy. He had me loose lipped on there. I was questioning what I said when I left. I was like a little cheap date. And Shade was super experienced too with the liquor stuff. He knows all about it. So that was a great drink. I had a drink the other night too. My friend Boomer made me one. It was pretty good. I don't remember what it was called, but I'm pretty simple when it comes to that. I think the uh, what was it? I think it was just like tequila and pineapple juice one time I had with Liz. That was really good. It was all good. <laughs> but yeah, he had me twisted on like the littlest amount of alcohol probably. Then we went for a crazy long walk too, so it was fun. It was fun. There's a uh, some nightlife happening in Gresham tonight, which is kind of a rarity, I guess, but PDX Event Center has a show there tonight. I'm probably not going to go. X-Rated's going to be there. Um, I kind of had a bunch of questions for X-Rated. I was kind of curious how he recorded that album in jail. Not really interested in that story as much as uh, who let him do it. He had to have some help on the way. He had to have some. Mm-hmm. Yep, yep. This trail actually connects. If you go to, yeah, see where it says to the ponds right here? If you, t you can go right to the ponds. Um, I think that trail doesn't go anywhere. I figured that out the other day. <laughs> There's a bunch of them that just go nowhere. I was being all adventurous. Thought I'd go down some. But make today count been practicing a few things saying no saying no is a weird one been practicing that uh, yeah I feel way better I feel way better than I did a few weeks ago you come to the realization that things you can't control you shouldn't worry about I think that was a big one as far as like managing managing my emotions let's do it one more time here we go but managing um, your emotions that's been a big one for me I didn't realize how bad I was at that either I don't say anything or I just ah, like snap real quick and just say something direct and sharp so I've been working on that definitely been working on that and protecting like you know, like I said, yeah, I don't want to repeat the shit that I said yesterday, but like those messages I've been getting from people in support are great. But there's like half of them I feel like that are just, they feel kind of snaky and like they just want the tea and, and, and pressure to continue to do what I'm doing. And they're not really like listening, <laughs> like they're telling, but no one's listening. But a lot of the other messages I've gotten have been very supportive very understanding very uh sympathetic to how much time and effort some of these things take and and they're okay with me taking a break they're okay with me getting my mind right and they've stayed in contact um the, the whole time through a lot of people uh but there are some that i haven't spoken to in six months eight months a year if ever they just want information about why it stopped and what's up with Birdie and, and where's Liz so I just have to protect some of that I just don't respond or it's nothing against you guys I feel like some people also are just too closely connected to what caused my damage so I'm just trying to give that a little space I'm trying to give a little space for everybody that's been affected by this in my circle so um, but yeah 
this is an exciting new feature for me in my life just to be able to, I don't know. I say my son's safe, but he's not at home. And I got this job starting Monday. Really looking to fast forward the next couple months with a lot of hard work uh, physically as well as with myself. And then uh, hope to have my own place here soon. Oh, that would be so nice. That would be so nice. But other than that, just been walking a lot, not thinking about content creation as much. That's why I really like these little lives. I mean, it just takes such a little amount of time and I kind of want to go on a walk anyway. So it's been super helpful. I don't have a lot to say today. I kind of feel like yesterday I kind of drained the bank, spilling, <laughs> spilling all my juicy life details but today is just uh trying to make the best of today still waiting on a few things i waiting on my paypal um uh this is in it's in fairview uh right by the target actually look yeah there's the target right here on halsey it's like right behind the target there's like a whole trail system here and it links you up to the salish ponds they stock the salish ponds with trout and stuff too, so it's a cool place to go fishing. There's always it's always quite a few people there hanging out too, so it's pretty safe. Uh, but yeah, it's a great little trail, great little pond. Come on, come on out sometime. Let's go for a walk. Let's go for a walk. Yeah, but finding a way to keep up with the content creation this is it this is about as best i'm going to give y'all for a while <laughs> it's so easy to do it's beneficial also like a little bit of therapy even like <laughs> i even told the lady i was like the, the therapist i did my intake with last week i even told her i was like i've been going online and kind of spilling my guts to everybody she's like that's okay <laughs> she's like that's all right she's like let people know you're vulnerable or whatever uh but I'll be better prepared for shit. I want to be better. I'm 45. I shouldn't even be saying that. I feel like I should be able to prepare it already. But I need to be better prepared for traumatic moments in my life and how to handle it. So not that you ever think about having traumatic moments, but like it seems like they happen quite a bit in life, um, whether you want to or not. Fellow photographer. Oh, yeah. He's out shooting today, too. They put these, uh, they put these borders up here to separate the parking lot at Target with all the, it's kind of weird, but it's like a big fence now. I think it's electric even. I don't know. But yeah, we, uh, I just have to find a better way again to like, yeah, yeah, that's right. Don't worry about it so much. Exactly right. Try not to, I'm not going to fuss on stuff I can't change. I'm not. And that goes for people, that goes for situations, that goes for, you know, just daily life. If I can't change it with my own efforts, like now or later, I'm not going to put a lot of energy into it because it just ends up wearing you down. So again, that goes for people, relationships, situations, money, your time, uh, practicing saying no, practicing saying I can't. How about just no, don't say you can't because I usually generally can, um, but I just don't want to do it. If you don't want to do something like, why would you ever put yourself through that? Why would you ever do that? Here's a little bridge right here, that's a little overpass. You can see the cars kind of race by. Here comes one. Maybe you can't see it, but I filmed a music video here actually with Is He Dead? That's right. Right there. Yeah, one of the scenes from the Is He Dead video was right there on that little edge. It's pretty cool. 
in the tunnel. If I lose you in the tunnel, I'm sorry. I don't know why it hates this so much, but maybe I won't do it. I'll have to watch it during playback. I'm sure it gets a little hairy, but. But that's me walking. That's a nice 30 minute walk that I got in there. I'll probably do a couple more of these today, these 30 minute walks. I've been getting in about four or five a day. Um, it's really been good for me. It's helpful. Come out and just clear your brain out. Maybe not clear your brain out. I'm sure I'm getting some sort of electrical radiation from that thing. But, but yeah, it's been a it's been a better way to spend my time and still make a little content, still connect with my peoples. Uh, but yeah, that's gonna do it for today. I'm gonna wrap it up. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you, Shado, for watching. Thank you, everybody that was checking it out. I'm sorry I can't remember everybody. I'm doing a lot here, but have a great day, and I will talk to y'all soon.